So some of you may remember from last year, we had a string of podcasts that we did food reviews on. So obviously mm -hmm. we're in a little different yeah. of a setting here. Yeah. Got a more advanced setup that's definitely... Um, yeah, we've upgraded. Definitely yeah. more likable, got better lighting, but we bring the food reviews back today. Mm -hmm. uh, we're gonna be starting off the school year of 24, 25, our last year of food yep. reviews for Cleaver Regional yeah. High School with it's a bang. Sentimental, sad. Acai bowls. Playa bowls. Same thing. So we're excited. Playa, it's something that we haven't had in a long time. Mm -hmm. I mean, I can't yeah, tell yeah. you the last time I've had Playa bowls. Yeah. And um, this is going to be interesting to see yeah. what we got. I remember my go-to, I believe my go-to order was the, I think I believe, I did get that again, was the peanut butter, was the Nutella acai bowl, but sub out the coconut flakes for peanut butter. Usually I get the like extra Nutella. I think I get what he gets, but with extra Nutella. But today I went a little bit different with the Cocoa Crunch something. Excited to try. It's gonna be interesting. So it's all about what we we go on this to try new things, yeah. try things that we we want to add to our palates. Mm -hmm. yeah. So uh, starting off with presentation, yours definitely looks nice. To show the camera, yours definitely looks it's very pretty, nicer very than mine. Pretty. You can um, see that. Mine Don't definitely uh, doesn't look bad. Yeah, yeah. I can't open it. Hold on. It doesn't look bad. Yeah. It's not awful, but I mean, it, you know, the strawberry is a little messed up. But granted, we were probably the first order of the day. We ordered this at yeah eight thirty. They probably made it by ten. So mm -hmm. you know, you never know. Um, I mean, I'm stuff excited. I, it looks like stuff. we got some yogurt in here. Let's take our first take our Nana. first bite. I didn't get enough. I didn't get any of the mm. fruit. It's very fresh. Mm -hmm. I like it. That's great. My, That's consistent. That's yeah. really consistent because I throw in the peanut butter here because peanut butter banana, that's a common yeah. item to put on a sandwich. You For know, sure. peanut butter, yeah. like a lot of people eat, I eat peanut butter and banana sandwiches, so... It balances out with the sweet acai mm. and Nutella mm. just strawberries so well. The coconut flavoring on my, um, the main meat of my bowl, if that makes sense, the main smoothie part is amazing. I Absolutely. really like it. This is mm -hmm. world class, I would say. Very, you know, sometimes coconut has like a weird aftertaste. Mm -hmm. It's just the creaminess of it, which is really good. Me personally, you know, I'm not a coconut fan. Mm -hmm. I never in my life have liked coconut. Like coconut flakes, I mean, I yeah, always yeah. substitute for peanut butter because I mean you know, I feel like extra protein. This is just for de decor, you know what I mean. For I don't sure. really know if this is like. Oh, there's some blueberries. Adds in much here flavoring too. to I don't it. I even know there was blueberries in mm. here. Mm -hmm. So Joseph, let's talk about the price. Is that this needs worth to be discussed for the price. What do you think? Our total order, my, obviously with dash fees, so we're we'll say without our order. I think yeah. this was fourteen dollars. Yeah, similar price for mine, thirteen, somewhere around there. So t our total order was forty was forty two. Yeah, but that's that was with dash the, fees. Yeah, so yeah, obviously course. that's normal. Nothing we can do about that. Yeah, I mean, <sighs> I, I mean, would say, I would say it is worth it. It is so? worth the price. I think one hundred percent. Really, this is because this is a lot of food. This they give you a lot of food for what it is. Fourteen dollars. Yeah, you're right. You're right. There's a lot of fruit on on here. You know, it fits in the palm of my hands though. I don't know. It's still, it's dense. Joseph, Joseph, respectfully, I'm going to have to disagree with you on this. Yeah, it's true. I mean, like, it tastes amazing. It's great. Yeah. But if I wanted a great deal, I'd go to Chipotle. You get more food for your <sighs> bang for your See, buck but Personally, here. <sighs> I mean, more calories. You know what I mean? It tastes great, but it's expensive, you know? It's pricey. My personal opinion. But I would think if you're willing to spend the money for it, yeah, for sure. It really, I mean, I'd say a comfortable price point that Definitely. I would want to spend yeah. on this would be like 10 bucks. Yeah. And I okay. know you can get one from, obviously, um, locals from around here know. You can get it from the Amish market at Mulca Hill. Oh, for yes. For $10. Yes. Maybe that's our and next next stop, perhaps. Perhaps, perchance. Um, yeah, yeah. You could, you could get it for 10, you could get this exact mm -hmm. bowl for $10. Yeah, yeah. Is it as good? No. Oh really? It's not you as don't good. think so? No. I haven't it's, tried it. They're like it's not as good. I think this one's better for mm. sure. Mm, great. Um, but I think for the price, 
It's worth it because you get, I mean, this is a lot of food. Look at this. This is dense. Okay. As compared to like other healthy, like fast food restaurants, if that makes sense, like Salad Works. Salad Works. Sometimes people would consider. Salad Works is respectively. Like Pancheros. How would you compare this to those places? Well, I wouldn't call Pancheros healthy fast food. My I wouldn't think so either. I was just category of, of healthy fast food. So, have you ever tried kava? Mm, yes. I would categorize Salad Works, John, uh, not Jamba Juice. What's it called? Um, John, it is Jamba. No, it is Jamba okay. Juice. It's in Glassboro, right across yeah, the yeah. street. Um, Those are healthy fast food options. Kava, the Mediterranean Bowl places. Oh chopped. yeah, yeah. So uh, honey yeah. grow. Yes, yeah. I would rank this not a top kava. Kava yeah. superior. Kava's, it's amazing. Kava's amazing. I've there's none near us though, so we cannot door dash. Unfortunately but, it can't be on the food review because yes. uh, we would hundred percent have done kava. Yeah, but yeah. I love kava. I would yeah. rank it. Top three. Top three, wow. Top three. Best healthy fast food options. There's no way you can Agreed. compete. Healthy. When we use the word healthy, I would also say it's top three. Yeah. And, and unhealthy, like you go McDonald's, Chick-fil-A, the whole I mean, retrospect. I mean, McDonald's unhealthy. is going to beat out acai bowls any day. I would rather I mean, have it. I mean, it just tastes better. It just tastes you know better. what I mean? But you know. You're, I know I eat. I personally like to eat very healthy. Yeah. That's just something that I like to do. Me too. This yeah. is a great option for me to mm-hmm. eat for a great price. And honestly, it's, I would say it's completely worth it. Yep. And um, it ranks, I would say it ranks pretty high in the health system, mm-hmm. on the health food system for sure. Um, mm-hmm. Now, Joseph, mm-hmm. what do you say about the fruit on here? Do you, does it taste fresh? Does it feel like it's been absolutely. sitting out all day? No, absolutely. Okay. Well, good. I we do did, believe. We did order it very early, so. Here's your napkin, by the way. Oh, thank you. <laughs> oh, it's under your, that's fine. <laughs> I do believe. Mm-hmm. It is fresh. It tastes fresh. It doesn't taste like Now, if we ordered this maybe tonight, possibly, these these fruits might not feel as fresh. No, definitely not. Maybe. I'm not sure. I'm not sure how often they cut new um, pieces of fruit up. So, but right now this tastes amazing. Mm -hmm. We actually had it in the fridge for like around a half hour. We did, yeah, we did uh, order a little, well, DoorDash unexpectedly came a little early. Mm-hmm. We ordered it for 10, 10 to 10 30. They came at 10 on the dot. Yeah. So, yeah. so that was in the, so, you know, it was in the driver's car and then we put it in the fridge. And so it's definitely not the freshest, but it still tastes very fresh. So. Yeah. I mean, after it yeah. being sat out for a little bit, obviously pliables from our, from Clearview. Yeah. It's probably a good 15 minutes away. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And so obviously the DoorDash took 15, 20 minutes to get here. Mm hmm. So, and then took us five minutes to go and get it. So that's almost 30 minutes of it sitting yeah. out. And and it still tastes very fresh. And yeah. don't forget, we also put it in the uh, fridge, which obviously, you know, yeah. it keeps it fresh, but also it can go makes, bad in the fridge. Yeah, it can make I mean? everything go, get misogynized, if that makes sense. Everything yes. mixed together. So, but I want to say right now, the granola on here, it still has a great crunch factor. Mm-hmm. I mean, it's amazing. I I love it. Absolutely. It's a great meal. I'm happy with this lunch. This will fill me up for the rest of the day. I'll be good to go. Yeah, me too. Yeah. So, for our final rating, I would pro- Let's let you go first. I want to know what your final rating My is. My final rating for uh, foods like this, like acai bowls and things and smoothies, mm-hmm. I would give it a 9-8. Nine, eight. Nine, wow. Eight. Yeah. Just as, like, general food, I give it, like, a seven five, really? That's yeah. low. No, oh no, no. I I consider a seven five pretty high. I mean, okay. I'll give it an eight on an eight for normal food, definitely. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I would say in terms of acai bowls, a very easy nine six. Yeah. This is the king of acai bowls mm. right here. This is the uh, uh, pliable is the mecca for acai bowls. They, I mean, there's a they reason did it it's first. so popular. Yeah, they did it first. So. I would say, in terms of entire f- 
fa- healthy fast food spectrum rating, I would give it also probably similar to a nine two. But then mm. on the the food itself rating, I have to go with an eight three. Eight three. Okay. It gets the job done, but there's nothing about it that makes me go, "Holy cow, this yeah, is the greatest right. thing I've ever had." Right. Agreed. So, I would, pr- yeah, eight three. I'm com- I'm a confident eight three, eight, three on eight, this. Eight three. Yeah. Our pliables right, nice. rating to you, eight point three out of ten. Nice. So, right. what's what's next? What's next? What's I next? mean, we're, we'll, we'd uh, love to hear some feedback in the comments, what you guys want us absolutely. to try. Absolutely. That would be amazing. Um, yeah. Uh, but I'm thinking I was interested in Raising Cane's, but I know this guy does not like Raising Cane's. I'm a Raising Cane's hater. Yeah. So a Hater with we'll, a capital H. We have to find common ground somewhere. We'll see what we want. Yeah. We're, um, but should be coming to you in uh, the next couple weeks the yep. next uh, the next episode so yep. make sure to stay tuned yep we will yep. all righty have All a right. good day guys see you guys us signing off